Good morning, all my paper chasers from Life Squad, all my YouTubers, Facebookers, CDL holders, man. Hope everybody doing all right this morning. Um, over here with the new company, getting ready to start on my first load. And uh, I'm not going to be doing a video for every load that I do. Uh, I think I'm just going to uh, do a video like once a week, something like that. And then explain to y'all like where I've been and stuff like that. And uh, where I'm going and stuff like that. So uh, that's that's going to be changing it up. But I will be doing shout outs on every video that I do. And uh, just, to, just to give you guys thanks for all the support and all the subscriptions and the comments, man. Appreciate that. Y'all get a video a thumbs up. Comment, subscribe to the channel and stuff like that. But uh, I'm getting ready to start on my first load. I got to go to uh, Wayne's Farm to pick up a load uh, here in Decatur, uh, over in Decatur, Alabama. And bring it over to Mount Sterling, Illinois. So uh, starting on my first load and uh, going to see how it goes, man with the new company here and uh hopefully everything goes good but shout out to all of y'all man all my all my doubles and triples all my ltl drivers all my uh uh doubles and triples no, i said doubles and triples all my tankers all my fuel guys all my uh uh cement mixers all my oil field workers uh uh all the uh all the uh uh you name it, man. You name it. If you got a CDL, you're doing it right. Ain't no doubt we family for life. So if y'all ready to get started on this week, let's get started on this week, man. God bless you all, and we'll see y'all in a little while. Yes, uh, uh. my people what up what up what up made it over here on the first load when it got loaded up man and came over here to cornersville tennessee over here at uh exit 22 on i-65 no matter if you're going north or south on 65 it's gonna be exit 22 man here at the pilot got a good fuel discount uh we get some good fuel discounts here man it's 369 here but that's not what i paid i paid uh 309 so Save 60 cents on fuel right there and uh, weighed my load, man. And uh, get ready to show y'all the scale ticket here. That's where I'm at. Exit 22, Cornersville. Got uh, 11,840 on the on the stairs. I had 26,680 on the drives and 28,100 on the trailer. I uh, got. 88 gallons of fuel because I put 80 gallons in the truck and I put 8 gallons of reefer and I put 3 gallons of DEF but uh so all together 88 gallons of fuel 
and uh, that added a, like another 600 pounds to it so that made it 27 to I'll just say 27 280 on the uh, drives so I moved it back two holes and made that uh, 27 300 on the drives and with that 600 made it 27 2 but I added so that's 28,000 right now on the drives and 27 300 on the uh, trailer so we're gonna ride with it like that man I'd rather be heavier on the uh, on the truck than I am on the trailer you don't want to be dragging the trailer especially uh, going up hills and mountains and stuff like that you don't want to be dragging the trailer you want to be uh, more on your drives because that fuel will burn off so uh, we're gonna get up out of here man we're gonna head on toward uh head on toward Mount Sterling Illinois y'all sit back enjoy the ride man and I'll uh, get y'all holler later let y'all know where I'm at man y'all be safe God bless we'll see y'all in a little while yes sir check in with the guard uh they'll send you over to the uh the shipping office and uh, you'll go over there and you'll park right before you get there and you'll see where to where to walk in at and then you sign in give them your phone number and stuff like that and then they'll assign you a door and uh got that loaded up yesterday and now i'm over here in mount sterling illinois when you check in over here at the gate uh you bring in your paperwork and uh they'll have you go to a little kiosk there i'm here at dot foods here in mount sterling illinois and uh you'll go to the little kiosk and put in your information on that and take a picture of your driver's license a picture of yourself and then uh they'll send you back around here to the docks back here i'm back in the door 183 back here in the far back 
and they give you a little gate code, I mean a little gate pass. So when you're done, you just stop back by there on your way out, give them your gate pass, and then you're out of here. And uh, from here, I'm gonna head up to uh, Stevens Point, Wisconsin, to pick up load number two, and that's going over to Allentown, Pennsylvania, for Tuesday. So uh, uh, just want you guys to sit back and y'all check in, checking in with y'all. And uh, when I get over to Stevens Point tonight, uh, I'll do shout outs and stuff like that. But uh, y'all sit back, enjoy the ride, enjoy the rest of your day. God bless y'all, man. And we'll holla at y'all tonight. Yes, sir. Peace, my people. All my paper chasers for life squad, man. All my people, man. Y'all know if y'all seeing me, y'all know what time it is. I'm over here at a quick trip over here in uh, Stevens Point, Wisconsin, man. Ready to go pick up my load tomorrow. Told y'all I would do shout outs once I got here. Hope everybody doing all right, man. Hope y'all out there doing your thing. And hope everybody being safe out there. Um, it's been a good company so far. I know this is my first load. I can't really... Uh, uh, give you guys any assessment on how the company is I can only tell you what I know for sure for right now um, it's a good company seems like they care about their drivers <clears throat> seems like they care genuinely to see you succeed um, met some drivers here that have paid off their trucks and uh, been here for, for years uh, met a guy that's uh, paid off one truck. He's got a team in that truck now. And he's back here to do another lease purchase. Um, shout out to you, bro. Uh, met an a older gentleman named Robert. Uh, he's paid off a few trucks with this company. And uh, now uh, uh, he has drivers driving those trucks. And all he does here now is just go recover trucks for him. Um, met a guy that drives a Volvo and, uh, he paid his Volvo off and he loves it here. He's been here for seven years. Met another driver that's been here nine years. It's a good company, man. They have a lot of drivers. I didn't get to meet everybody, but they've had a lot of drivers that have paid off their trucks and, uh, they believe in, uh, doing a three year lease once you finish that three-year lease you can uh either pay it off through your maintenance account or you can refinance it with the bank and uh and keep paying on it till you own it and the good thing is about this company is once you pay a truck off you don't have to leave you can stay here you can put driver a driver or drivers in your truck that you paid off here and you can start a whole new lease program with them. And uh, it's, it's wonderful, man. It's a great company. I will be giving y'all the name of the company sooner or later.
But for now, guys, you know, respect my wishes and, you know, just uh, let me give it to y'all when I'm ready to give it to y'all. Y'all can speculate all you want, but um, it's a great company, man. And I think it's going to really work out. And uh, my first week, I don't have to make a truck payment. After that, truck payments are going to be, uh, uh, they're going to be reasonable to where it could be done. So, um, uh, I, I don't see why I can't pay a truck off here. I got a 2022 Freightliner Cascadia. Show y'all around right quick, man. Then we're going to get off into these shout outs. But, uh, that's my bunk back there. That's my closet. Um, uh, that's my refrigerator right there. I got a big old refrigerator, man. This thing has a, uh, this thing has a, uh, it's got the refrigerator part at the bottom. Then you got a freezer at the top. I ain't put nothing in the freezer yet because I don't have a microwave. My microwave is at home and I'm not going home yet. But, uh, there's my TV over there. Got plenty of storage. There's my top bunk up there. Not using it, but nothing but for storage. But it's got plenty of storage, man. Beautiful truck. Um, more storage up there. Y'all see it, man? More storage. That's my closet right there. And, you know, it's pretty comfortable, man. Safe ride. Doing pretty good with it, man. Uh, getting great fuel mileage with the truck already. I'm getting nine miles to the gallon right now has both tanks has an apu on it and uh uh it's, it's wonderful you can even use the apu for heat you don't have to have a separate s-bar system it's already built into the apu i have the uh ap the evolution apu unit on here and uh yeah it, it uh it gets uh fuel out of the tank or whatever but um hey man it only wastes like not as near as the older APUs waste. Like the older APUs waste like usually like about a, a gallon or so in a 10 hour period or something like that. This one only wastes like a quarter of that guys. I mean, this, this APU is awesome. And uh, I'm loving it so far, man. And uh, it's great, it's great guys. But uh, I'm gonna get off into these shout outs, man. Because uh, I'm ready to get some rest, watch some TV, kick back, watch some TV, and then get up tomorrow and head on over to Wisconsin. I mean, uh, over to uh, uh, where I'm picking up my load at, service cold storage. Pick up my load or lineage. What I, I think it's lineage, but I'm just going to say uh, service cold storage. But I think it's lineage. But i uh, going to pick up my load from over there tomorrow and get that done and start heading toward uh allentown pennsylvania so uh let's get off into it man hope y'all are doing your thing out there man hope y'all chasing that paper first up is gonna be david d uh 1564 i appreciate you man appreciate your support brother uh jason johnson i appreciate you uh to a couple of my people over there in san antonio texas my boy philip h out of san antonio what's up my brother my man Harry Dan Smith over there in San Antonio, Texas. Shout out to the great state of Texas. Shout out to uh, San Antonio. Yes, sir. Shout out. Let me know. Uh, leave me a comment. Let me know where you guys are from, man. That way I can send a shout out to you and your town where you live at or your hometown where you live at, man, and stuff like that. No doubt. Anonymous Trucker. Shout out to you, brother. Solo. Shout out to you, brother. Uh, Harrison Brown. Shout out to you. Uh, my man Mike Lee that was in uh, uh, orientation with me shout out to you Mike to all the people that uh, I was in orientation with man shout out to y'all man no doubt Prince Diamond shout out to you my man DC they wanna you definitely up in there DC I appreciate you my brother my man Kirk Kitchen I appreciate you Kirk I'm not gonna show the truck I'm not going to show the truck right now, Kirk, so you won't be able to see whether it's clean or not. But just trust me, bro. It's a nice truck. It's red and uh, it needs a bath, but I'm going to be running in the rain over the, uh, going over the PA and stuff like that. So just know it's a nice truck, Kirk. I will start showing it at some point, my man. No doubt. <laughs> my man, Brandon Balderas out of L.A. Shout out to you, Brandon. 
Shout out to my man Beast of Logan. Shout out to you, my homie. Yes, sir. Shout out to Lamar 85 LA. You definitely up in there over in LA. Shout out to my LA crew, man. Yes, sir. Um, to my man Aaron Fox out of Bullhead City, Arizona. Shout out to you, Aaron. I appreciate you. My man Tom in Odessa, Texas. Yes, sir. The, state, the great state of Texas is definitely up in the house, man. Shout out to you, Tom, and your family, brother. Much love. Yes, sir. Uh, shout out to my man Bobby Craps up in Springfield, Massachusetts. The great state of Massachusetts is definitely up in the house. Shout out to you, Bobby. What's happening, baby? Yes, sir. Uh, to my man Al Nunnery out of Cleveland, Tennessee. The great state of Tennessee is in the house. Cleveland, Tennessee is in the house. What's up, Al and Cindy? Hope you guys are doing all right, man. Love you guys. My man, Marcus White. I appreciate you, man. My man, Dietrich Nash. I appreciate you, my brother. My man, Greg Monholen out of Michigan. Shout out to you, Greg. Hemi Hollers definitely up in the house. Yes, sir. What's up, Greg? Uh, to Keith Kennyberg. I, I appreciate you, brother. Shout out to you, my brother. AWSR Trucking. I appreciate you, my brother. Henry Price. I appreciate you. Henry Johnson. Y'all go check him out, my man out of Kentucky. Shout out to you, Henry. No doubt, man. Y'all check him out on YouTube. Henry Johnson on YouTube. Y'all go check him out, man. Clinton Gilreth. I, I appreciate you, my brother. I will try to keep the music down some on the videos, man. Uh, Mr. Nacho, shout out to you, my brother. No doubt, man. I appreciate you, brother. And last but not least, my man, David Cooperator. David Cooperator out of Berlin, New Hampshire. The great state of New Hampshire is definitely up in the house. Berlin, New Hampshire is definitely up in the house, man. Like I said, I appreciate all y'all, man. Y'all go down below. Go check out the merchandise, man, and, and g Dog's, uh store, man. Go check it out. Click them little three lines at the top up there, man, so y'all can check it out, man, and get your merch. I still haven't put out the new merch yet, guys. It's, it's been a delay on it because uh, I didn't like the way some of it came out when they showed it to me so i gotta go and get with them and rework it and uh do it like that man but just know guys that the new merch has come out it, it, the new merch is coming out it's a whole bunch of new stuff guys y'all will be amazed man y'all gonna love it and uh i hope y'all uh get in there and, and and get some of it help the channel out man if you don't you know that's fine man you know i Hey, I'm not pressing y'all to do anything you don't want to do, man. And I'll never ask y'all for a dime out of your pocket, man. If you see my merch, you like my merch, man, go cop my merch. You know, if you don't, then that's up to you, man. I can't, I can't, uh, stress that enough. Uh, another thing I love about this new company, man, great fuel discounts. Great fuel discounts. And I have both tanks. I have both tanks. But, uh, I'm primarily going to be using one tank, which is the driver's side tank, because uh, a weight, you know, having the APU and having weight, that extra weight with the APU and stuff like that. So you got to be kind of careful on how you load here. So, you know, of your, of your of the weight of your loads and stuff, and you're trying not to have uh, full tanks when you go get loaded. It's best to have half a tank when you go get loaded that way uh you can make it to a scale where your load after i mean way look where your load after you get it uh loaded up where your load and then fuel up according to how much weight you got on your trailer and stuff like that so that's the thing to be uh concerned about and uh i'll get it done man ain't no doubt about it your boy out here scrapping your boy out here getting it your boy out here chasing that paper hope all y'all doing the same we'll see y'all on the next version of the shout outs y'all be safe god bless y'all love you all man thanks for the support and we'll holla at y'all then yes sir uh... all right guys we made it down here over here to wisconsin over here to uh, Stevens Point, over here at the uh, Lineage Logistics, is actually actually Lineage Logistics, and we're going to back in the door 74, and you leave.
your door is closed here. Once you get here, you check in at the driver check-in and uh, they give you a door. They want you to leave your doors closed and uh, back into your door. And then uh, you'll have the red light once they start loading you. And then once you get the green light, uh, after they done loading you, once you get the green light, you'll uh, get out, they'll call you to come get your paperwork or you can get out and walk the door 100 and uh, they will uh, they will give you your paperwork and you'll be all done. Gotta wait for this uh, yard dog to back in and then we'll go down the door uh, 74. We're going back in the door 74. So uh, I'm here, here on my uh, second load and like I said, I'm just putting out a video once a week and uh, be doing a review of the week uh, once I drop this load off over in Allentown, Pennsylvania. Then that's when I'll end the video and uh, just do a quick review of the week and uh, my first two loads with the company and stuff like that. But uh, it's been pretty good. Orientation was pretty cool. They fed us real good. Um, you can you can genuinely tell you can genuinely tell that they care about the drivers here. It's a good company where I'm at and uh, loving it so far, man. Loving it so far, guys. It's 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 pretty good, pretty cool, and uh, you feel like you're somebody here instead of just a driver or a truck number. You you actually feel like you're somebody here, and uh, they treat you with respect. Um, they, they show much love to you and they just want to see you succeed. So I'm glad I took the, I'm glad I took the, uh, journey to do it and, uh, just going to try to get it done guys. And hopefully you guys will come along on the journey with me and we'll get it all done, man. We'll holler back at y'all a little bit. I'm at my door and going to start backing in right now. So, uh, I'll get back with you guys in a little while. Y'all be safe. God bless. Hey, what up all my people? Made it over here to a quick trip over here in Plover, Plover, uh, Wisconsin. Exit uh, 151 off of 39, no matter if you're going north or if you're going south, it's going to be exit 151 over here on I-39. Look at here, Plover, Wisconsin. All right, we got 11.9 on the stairs. We had 31, 380 on the drives and 34 160 on the trailer i slid it back four holes which is 1600 pounds so that'll give me 32 980 on the drives and uh minus 16 32 560 on the trailer so uh 32 560 on the trailer so i feel like that's a good spot and i still have I have a tank of fuel, so uh, I'll drive until it's time for me to get fuel, and then I'll probably put like about uh, about 100 gallons in, you know, about 700 pounds, and uh, uh, we'll just go from there, or I'll just fill up one tank, you know, and, and just go from there, man, because I don't want to be overweight and stuff like that, so uh, we're going to get rolling with this load, man, but... Uh, a nice truck stop in there quick trips are pretty nice they got they got food in there and stuff like that and uh pretty cool man people up here in wisconsin are real nice and stuff like that and uh i don't mind coming up here and and uh talking with people because they're real nice people around here and stuff like that or throughout the whole state every time i've come to wisconsin people have been nice but you know uh here at the quick trips they're real nice and uh you know good people man so i'm gonna get up out of here y'all sit back enjoy the ride man let's get on over to allentown pa yes sir
what it do, what it do this Tuesday morning, all my wonderful people over here in Allentown, PA, over here at the Americold, getting unloaded, man. My appointment wasn't till one o'clock, but uh, they getting me unloaded early, man. Right now it's 1025 up here, and uh, that's pretty cool, man. I got here about an hour ago, and uh, got here about an hour ago, and uh, when you get here, you don't have to check in with a guard, but it's an office where you park in the uh, you park in the holding area, and uh, then you walk over to the office and get checked in, and uh, they give you a piece of paper here, give you a piece of paper, and uh, just put that on your front windshield or whatever, and then you return it back to them once you're unloaded, and uh, and then you're out of here, man. But uh. Uh, that's gonna do it for the video guys uh, first week with the company uh, it's going pretty good uh, uh, our cutoff is on Mondays at 4 30 but um, my dispatch said that uh, he would push this load through for me so I can get paid for it this Friday this Friday will be my first paycheck so uh, hey man they hold a the week in the hole and uh, you know I started orientation last Tuesday and uh, got up out of there and uh, didn't didn't get rolling until Friday and so uh, went up to Illinois dropped that load off then went to Wisconsin and picked up this load and dropping it off today here on Tuesday um, and uh, it's going pretty good man pretty good company so uh, think I'm a, think I'm gonna be here man and, and try to pay the truck off but uh we'll see how it goes guys first week was pretty good man you know made some good revenue and stuff like that so uh no complaints no complaints so far but uh if i if i do have any complaints you guys will know about it because i ain't gonna sugarcoat anything man i'm gonna tell it like it is but uh that'll do it for the video i appreciate all you guys for the love and support man all the subscriptions all the comments like I say, man, leave me a comment. Let me know where you live at so I can uh, give you a shout out for it. And uh, we're going to say love, peace, and hair grease. Y'all be safe, man. Enjoy the rest of your week. And uh, we're going to get ready to get started on, on week number two. So uh, let's get on to the next episode, man. Love you guys. Have a safe week. God bless you all. We'll see y'all on the next episode. Yes. Uh, G-Dog. Out.